can you believe it? It's seven weeks that we've been in lockdown here. Seven weeks. And that's an interesting coincidence because we are in the seven week period between Pesach and Shavuot, a time of semi-mourning, a time the Talmud says that there is a moment next week on Tuesday night to Wednesday, the 33rd day of the Omer period, where that sadness lifts. Why is this period so sad? The Talmud says the great Rabbi Akiva had 24,000 students and they died during this period of a mysterious illness that stopped up their throats. Perhaps it was a virus like COVID-19 or perhaps, as the Talmud says, the real reason that caused their deaths was their inability to treat each other with respect. We don't know how long this period that we're in lockdown is going to end or what will come next. But like Akiva students, we feel vulnerable. We do not know where our journey is going or how and when it's going to end. Time is taking on a strange and unexpected quality. But we know that this experience of time is changing what we feel is important to us. Life is becoming simpler and we are identifying what it is that really matters. Living lives with meaning, living a life of kindness, with care, respect, of love, of learning, on what it means to be able to move forwards with hope and to be able to hold each other as closely as we can on this utterly unimaginable journey from Pesach to Shavuot. Shabbat Shalom.